Okay, so welcome to Foxtech and in this video, let's talk about how you can customize Notion on your iPad. Now, Notion, as you know, is a very nice productivity tool, which I use all the time. And there are very extensive customization options. So let's get started. At first, let's talk about text styling. Notion supports various text formatting options like bold, interlinks, strike through, inline code, comments, but to apply these styles, you can use the keyboard shortcuts like Command plus B for bold or Command plus I, you know, Command and S to strike through, you know, the usual ones which you also use on a Word, for example, on your computer or in some other text editor. Another big customization feature or option is by clicking on the three dots option in the upper right corner of your page and this allows you to change the font of every single thing you type within that page but there are actually like three fonts which you can pick from there is the default serif and mono so it's up to you to decide the default and mono look very uh, similar so yeah you just pick the one that you like i don't think you can import your custom fonts but at least this is a way to customize it now so yeah, you also have some color options. Notion allows you to change both inline text color and block colors with a variety of choices. This feature helps in highlighting important sections and making your page visually appealing. So you can use different colors to categorize uh, information. You can simply just select the text and scroll through the available options and you can just find the stuff that you want. You can click on the a and all the options just keep on popping up so you can just customize as you go right for example there's also the option for call out blocks so if you click on the plus icon there are so many different ways how you can embed text like there are the titles subtitles toggle headings and you know the to-do list tasks and like so many different things so I'll obviously use those but the one which i quite like is the call out which is like a very important message that is supposed to fit in like a like a block of text with a you know like a distinct background and a light bulb icon to indicate that it is important so you can also use that but it's up to you right but also very important is customization option is using the uh, icons for each pages as you can see i have all of my icons like labeled you can import your own icons or just choose emojis a lot of times using emojis is pretty enough but sometimes you might want to just import a a custom image for an icon but that one should be like a square image perhaps with no background so you need to play with that a little bit emojis are very simple so yeah these are the most common ways how you can customize notion but it all mostly comes down to the plus button which allows you to import like spotify you know google maps and pictures and links and all the great stuff so this is the main way to customize it hope you found this tutorial useful if you did make sure to hit the thumbs up subscribe below and i will catch you in the future that's it for now <laughs>